Hi people, it's Dr. Bacon and I'm going to tell you a little bit about watering. I've got some new plants started that are about a week old and so I'm just going to start them on water. They get watered every third day or so and uh, I want to tell you a little bit about what where my water comes from. So all of my water that I use for my plants gets stored in this 22 gallon Tupperware container and it goes through a garden hose and through one of these affordable, about $30 on Amazon, spa filters, which are good for 10,000 gallons. The fill rate is only about a gallon or two per minute, so it takes a long time to fill a big container, but that's part of the compromise of using an inexpensive and small filter. And this is a uh, activated carbon filter with a ceramic insert that removes um, heavy metal, which is very important. All of my water gets pH'd. If you don't have one of these, buy yourself a little pH kit. These are less than $20 on Amazon. And they're very simple. I actually just shot this video once before and pH'd my water and the whole shot was, the whole thing was out of focus. So uh, what you're looking for is a color that resembles a tennis ball that is the color you want. That's 6, 6.5, and that's a nice neutral pH. Uh, if your pH test comes up green, add a couple big drops of that. If it comes up blue, go that way. And that's really the extent of what I do for my water preparation. Uh, once the plants are a little bigger, I'll start using SM90, which is a surfactant and helps um, the roots get the moisture out of the soil more efficiently and re-wet the soil and then nutrients as they get bigger. But for now, uh, that's what we do for water. I hope you have a super day. Please like and subscribe and thanks for checking me out. Bye.